All right, what's going on, everybody? This is Coach Daniela Alvarez Jiu Jitsu. Today I have Miss Hope. I have Hope with me today. Hope, how long have you been training Jiu Jitsu? Almost three years. Almost three years. So, what belt are you now? Uh, green belt with the black stripe. Okay, green belt with black stripe. And tell me how you kind of found Jiu Jitsu or why you started. Um, my mom met somebody, I, I forgot where we were, but we were doing something, and my mom had talked to someone's dad and introduced us to it. And she thought it would help with my anger issues. So. Okay, so how, has it helped at all? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, what um, other ways has Jiu Jitsu helped you in? I lost a lot of weight and got fit. Okay. Well, so before Jiu Jitsu, were we working out, playing other sports? No, not really. I wanted to, but my family's really lazy. So. Okay, so yeah. not really a lot of physical activity. Mm -hmm. And before Jiu Jitsu, what about like eating habits? Were they good oh, or bad? They were bad. It's bad. Horrible. So now we're in Jiu Jitsu for three years, we're losing weight, we're mm -hmm. getting fit, eating healthy, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so do you eat better now that you change Jiu Jitsu? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> What's well, kind of like an example of how you would eat before compared to now? Uh, I would just like go in and like eat a bunch of sweets and like chips and whatever is in the cabinet. Whatever you could find. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you no, know, um, like I kind of would snack on vegetables, but it's just like, oh, chips. Yeah, the easy stuff, right? Yeah. Yeah, and then now? I kind of, whenever we go shopping, I like make my parents buy vegetables, which they don't like. It's more expensive, but. Yeah. Okay, so you kind of help them and a little make, bit eat yeah. healthier too? Yeah, because My before. dad's kind of tried to get into being more healthy too. So All right, like, cool, totally good. Um, so how old are you? 15. 15. And you're going to go to what grade soon? I'm going to be a sophomore. Sophomore in high school. Okay, so um, Jiu Jitsu is really kind of a, a self-defense, right? And it's a good thing for mm -hmm. learning how to protect ourselves, kind of stand yeah. up for ourselves. So now you've been training for a good amount of years. Do you feel like you're in high school, if you have like, I don't know, bully situation or anything like that, you kind of protect yourself? Do you have confidence in yourself now? Yeah. Kind of more training Jiu Jitsu now? Yeah? Yeah. Okay, good. So tell me something else that you like about Jiu Jitsu besides maybe the getting healthier part. What else? Um, I like how like willing people are to help you. Like the coaches and the people around you. Everybody wants to help you learn and help you with that journey. Okay, so you have a kind of supporting group here, right? Mm -hmm. uh, making new friends at all? Yeah. Yeah? Right. Hanging out with any other any people from outside of the gym or anything like that? No, because I'm really busy all the time. Yeah. But I definitely have like a group of friends that enjoy. Alright, really cool. Uh, tell me something else. What else do we like? Um, what's your favorite move? What's your favorite thing to do in Jiu Jitsu? When you come to class and you're like, time to like live train and live roll, like what's your I don't like know special? If I have like a favorite move, but it seems like I always do arm bars. Arm bars? Alright, so, I like arm bars too. It's a good good one, right? It seems like I always get in that position. Yeah, alright. So have you competed before? Yeah, I haven't done competitions in a while, but I have. Okay. How have you learned anything from that? Like anything that you can tell us about competing? Um, I learned that you definitely shouldn't eat before you weigh in because, yeah. <laughs> weigh in's always a struggle, right? <laughs> yeah. Um, and that you just have to kind of get yourself in the mood, listen to your music, definitely warm up before, drink a lot of water, and eat healthy. Don't bring any heavy food or anything like that. So do you think that you kind of grow whenever you compete? You have to kind of train hard and push yourself a little bit? Yeah, because yeah. you kind of get into a rhythm with the people that you train with every day, and it's kind of like a, a good challenge yeah. when you go to the competition. Yeah, because you kind of know what you're expecting, right, in the mm -hmm. gym. So when you go out there, you kind of you kind of really see where your game is, right? Yeah, you, kind you of see what other gyms Mistakes, and you kind of get to fix those and mm -hmm. stuff, yeah. All right, really cool to hear from Miss Hope. Miss Hope helps with uh, kids' classes as well, so she's really involved in the gym. So really good to hear from you. We're going to go and say bye to everybody watching. Bye. All right. <laughs>